One of the most common conditions that people think of when they think about the chiropractor is the adjustments to the neck or the cervical area. Now this doesn't have to be scary. We don't really care about how loud of a pop sound that is or if there's any kind of pop sound. What we're looking for is restoring the motion between the muscles, the joints, the fascia if it's tight. So when we look through here and we see if there's any dysfunction, if there's any muscle tightness, we'll definitely take him through all the orthopedic tests, making sure he doesn't have a disc injury or any type of herniation through that area. If he's okay and he's able to be treated, then we'll take him through the treatment. It's gonna be very similar to how we would work on anything through the upper body. We want to affect these big trap muscles that are the big players coming all the way up and through here. There's some smaller muscles to the underside that work from the shoulder blades up into this area. And it's a very normal sensation and a common sensation that you'll see, commonly called a crick in the neck for a lot of people that work desk jobs, people that have, you know, tension through here while they're picking up their kids, anybody that sleeps wrong after a big night, that kind of stuff happens. One of the other muscle areas that I really work on is on the front side, of the, again, that those pec clavicular muscles, if they're pulling tight, it pulls the collarbones down and makes the front muscles, the SCMs, these great big guys, really pull tight. We wanna bring those back to a normal position. So part of my treatment with any type of cervical issue is definitely working the collarbones. For the muscle work, we'll generally get in there with the Graston tools, work out the muscles to this area. You can get one of the small specific ones to work the ligaments if those are tight and they're restricting proper motion. What we're trying to do is restore balance to the area. And you'll be surprised how much you can do without actually getting in there and doing the chiropractic adjustment. Now, being chiropractors, I definitely think it is well worth getting the neck adjusted. Obviously, because it's one of those that's a scary one for new type patients, if they don't want to get it done, we definitely don't push it in this office. But usually it's a very quick responding issue, typically two to three visits.